Welcome to a new video where we are going to talk about how to use LaTeX system to prepare nice beautiful documents in Windows. So here is the Wikipedia page where you can learn about how the LaTeX started and it started with this text. It was started in 1978 by Donald Knuth and then afterwards it converted into two different ways latex and latex is nowadays being used mostly in preparation of uh, you know reports scientific journal articles thesis in computer science engineering physics mathematics especially latex was built to write mathematical statements mathematical documentations and later it was used to you know uh, all types of different document preparations and the one of the good uh, you know advantage of using LaTeX is that it can produce very very nice looking uncluttered documents when you are starting with uh, you know writing a LaTeX or preparing a LaTeX document uh, then there is a little bit steep learning curve but afterwards you get uh, acquainted with or accustomed with uh, the environment and then it you will find it much more you know uh, appealing in contrast to other document preparation setups like microsoft office and so forth so let's be uh, you know uh, see what kind of you know documents that you can produce so here are some templates and when you are learning the LaTeX for the first time, I would suggest you to use some templates. Templates are the best way to start with. For example, here is a site where you can find different templates. And here are uh, templates for article journals, general article, assignments, calendars, books, conference posters, cover letters, essays, and so forth and here is another you know website where you can get the the other uh, examples of a similar you know templates and both these websites i like the most and whenever i find uh, you know uh, to write a different kind of document then i first look at these two websites and find out my you know go to uh, templates and then use them and we'll come back using a latex you know a template later on after we start with the setup so in this video first we are going to make how to prepare the setup or the environment where you can write prepare a latex document within the windows 10 environment within windows there are two things that we are in need of to prepare the environment the first one is called Technic Center. This is like an editor where you can write the texts and mathematical statements and so forth. So here is the place where you can download the Technic Center from. And uh, in this case, the Technic Center that you are going to use is going to use another back-end support called mic text we'll download that later so first let us download the technic center so in case of the technic center you will find two versions 32 bit and 64 bit of course you will download mostly 64 bit so here we have uh, downloaded the 64 bit and then we are now going to download the mic tech so here is the website for the mic tech and mictech.org so there you go and right away download the executable and you also if interesting you will see that this mictech is available for different operating systems but we are doing it in windows so we download the windows version and so once the executables are downloaded completely then you can start installing the executables for this right now we have already downloaded these two executables and first we start with the technic center the setup file 
and the installation process for the Technic Center is quite simple. First, you accept the license agreement, and then you just go ahead and install the you know uh, the Technic Center application. So this is very fast you know installation process. Very small uh, the setup file. Once you have this uh, setup running then it will go through a setup process where it will ask you to locate the mic tech distribution what we already downloaded so for that first let us install the mic tech so here is the mic tech installation wizard and this is again it will take some time but here it's saying that whether you want to install for everyone and then you go ahead and select here this is very important we'll come back to this probably later again and you say it yes okay uh, so you start installation and it takes a lot of time this installation process is very long so here i'm not showing everything so i'll cut short many uh, you know steps but overall it's just this that it, you have to wait for a long time for the installation to complete so as the installation is going on in the background, let us now look at the templates that I was saying earlier. So now what I'll go is download one of the template and prepare it for us to use the LaTeX environment that we are now installing in the background. So here I have chosen the article template. So what I'll do is I'll take the first one here and I'll download the template. So here is the zip file that is going downloading right now. And after the preparation of the LaTeX template, with the output would look like this. As you can see, this is a nice PDF. It looks really beautiful. So in the background, as we are downloading this, the installation process is going on. Still, it's not final. So let's uh, work on the template a little bit more. So here is the template. So you always work on a file with the file with the .tex extension. So now the installation is uh, more or less finished. And here you can see that it's asking for the update. So after you complete the installation, you would require you you to uh, it would ask you to update the you know setup later so one more thing here i am to say that this typesetting is free so if you want you can give some you know support show some uh, in appreciation for their work so now we have installed the mic tech now we have to give the path where the mic tech was installed so what I'll do, uh, this is the path for my system and I think in your, uh, when you try to install it, it will have the similar you know, path. You go C drive, program files, mic tag and then I think tags, uh, again mic tags and then bin, then x64 I think, yeah, so x64 and that's it. You select OK and that's the path you need to give and next you can leave all these these are optionals so I didn't do anything in this case so I left all these options to be empty it doesn't matter much so next and so we are done with the setup for the Technic Center so in the Technic Center what we have so this is a tip Every time you run the Technic Center, these tips will show up. So now we are setting up what we want. Through the Technic Center, we are trying to convert a LaTeX document into a PDF. So LaTeX to PDF, right? So now we'll incorporate the template.txt file, main.txt. And here is the text file. So first we'll just go ahead and compile. So these are the various parts of this document. We'll come back to this a little later again. So here is the file, that's the template. Let's see what happens. 
if we compile this uh, document so there is the compilation going on so what I did in this case there are some uh, you know style files .ste files are not available so I was not having my internet on so then I switched on the internet and then compiled again now it's compiling so once the compilation is done it may take you know a couple of minutes at the for the first time so now you see I have got my output the PDF file so here is the PDF file that was created through the Technic Center and Mike Tech in the background so you see this is a very nice PDF file that was created out of this .tex file and uh, here uh, there are various different part of uh, the latex uh, file generally you will have you know title author name then there will be some abstract there will be some sections there will be some other texts tables lists figures and all these so here I'm showing some of the parts that comes in the .tex file and then correspondingly in the PDF file so here is the abstract so this abstract appears here so these are the corresponding part that you just have to edit you take one sample uh, in a template and then you just don't go much detail into the .tex file let it be as it is and then edit the part where the main text comes in right so the best part with the LaTeX is that the setting of the document you don't have to worry about. You just have to worry about your text. Where to put bold, where to not to put bold, where to give a little bit space here and there. All this stuff will be taken care of by the template itself. You just have to put the text and the images and the so the main content you have to concentrate that's the beauty of the latex system in cell let's say let's say so here is the images and so forth it's shown i'm trying to show you here and uh, for example in case of office you have to think about all the typesetting by yourself in case of latex you take a template and you forget about the typesetting and of course you can change the uh, you know template itself the typesetting itself but that comes a little later when you are you know much experienced with this so here what i have done is i compiled it again so the bibliography also appears uh, so these are a little bit advanced you don't have to uh, worry about right now much so now what i'm going to do is update the mic tech console and so it was showing earlier that the mic tech what i downloaded was not updated so here it's saying that it's not updated much so you first have to update it right for the mic tech to have its full functionality you know restored so here i have to switch to administrative mode for the update to work and then i am right now showing you how to install a particular package you will see you will require sometimes extra packages to be installed so that's how you install some packages and this part is for advanced users if you like but I'm just showing it for the completeness so let's say I'm trying to be latex science so this is like if you are a science person and you are trying to uh, you know write some science document then for the preparation of bibliography the reference part of a document then you might need this uh, some of the you know uh, settings that comes with this then there are other packages what you can include so here I am looking at the updates which are required so I'm letting it to update by itself it takes a lot of time for the first update to work but I have skipped that so everything is done So I think during this video we have introduced you to the LaTeX typesetting and have gone through the how to build, how to set up the environment for preparing a LaTeX document. I have shown you the places where you can find the LaTeX templates and then download it, use it for your uh, you know preparation of the diff different documents, how to compile and how to 
see the different parts of the template and then correlate with the output and also how to you know uh, update and install different packages in case of the mic tech which is the backbone of this latex environment so with this thank you for watching the video